Is your iPhone making random calls when locked? You may think this to be a weird problem, but quite a few iOS users have faced the same problem. If you are faced with the same issue, keep watching. We will show you 6 methods to fix iPhone making calls on its own issue. Method 1. Disable voice control. Open your iPhone settings menu. Tap accessibility. Press voice control button. Then switch it to turn off it. Method 2. Disconnect Bluetooth devices. Check if your iPhone is connected to some special Bluetooth device. You can try to turn off the Bluetooth to see if it works. Method 3. Restart iPhone. Press and hold the power and volume down button until the slide to power off prompt appears on the screen. Then slide from left to right to shut down iPhone. Method 4. Update software of iPhone. To update iOS software on your iPhone, go to Settings, choose General, and click Software Update. If there is an available update, press the Download and Install button to confirm your update. The updating process will begin. Method 5. Reset iPhone settings. Reset all settings means resetting your iPhone to factory settings. Before adopting this way, do not forget to back up your data on iTunes. Go to Settings, click General. Click Transfer or Reset iPhone. Click Erase All Content Settings button. Click Continue, and enter the passwords to confirm this action. Method 6. Use JoyoShare Alt Fix iOS System Recovery Tool. If the issue still not resolved after you tried above methods, it is suggested to use iOS System Repair Tool, JoyoShare Alt Fix, which can fix more than 150 iOS issues which include iPhone making calls on its own issue, iPhone stuck on white screen iOS update failure issue or more. Firstly, install and launch JoyoShare Alt Fix on the computer. Plug your iPhone to the computer. After that, press the start button to proceed. You are now in the mode selection window. It is enough to select the standard mode, which will not cause any data loss. Then press the next button. In this menu, there is a guideline how to put iPhone into DFU or recovery mode and we need to put iPhone into DFU or recovery mode. Some of the info about your iPhone will be displayed on the screen. Make sure all the info is correct and change the wrong parts. Then press the download button to download the matching firmware package. Lastly, click the repair button. The downloaded firmware package will be unzipped, and the program will start to fix your iPhone issue. A few minutes later, the repairing process will finish, and your iPhone will come back to the normal.